Welcome to New York Jazz Academy Online. I'm Javier Rao, uh, the program director here at New York Jazz Academy. And I'd like to introduce you to a new free online class that we've launched called Jazz History 101. Uh, you have access online to just a wealth of archives um, of all sorts of jazz history documented. Tons, if you just go to a, a video sharing site like YouTube, you have access to more videos than <laughs> you're going to have time to watch in multiple lifetimes of all sorts of wonderful performances ranging through the history of jazz. You can also go to jazz historians' websites and read all sorts of information about jazz musicians and the history of jazz. There's just so, so much information out there. And I know if you've tuned in and you're watching this video, then you already have a real fascination for jazz history itself. The trick with having all of that content out there is really knowing how to watch it all and how to appreciate everything you're watching. What we're really attempting to do in this class is help you uh, develop a better understanding of jazz history. So we're going to walk you through uh, just a sampling of material that's already out there online and really help share with you um, some connections between all of these different jazz eras and different uh, players. Really trying to get a sense of how one player was influenced by another in terms of instrument. Um, jazz has a whole lot of genres or subgenres associated with it and really trying to make heads and, and tail of which genre was influenced by what and where the offshoots stemmed from. All of that I think is really, uh, it's all wonderful. I gotta say, jazz history is just something really, really special. So if you'd like to come along and you're watching this video through a video sharing website like YouTube, make sure you also visit New York Jazz Academy online and actually register for this free class. When you register, you're going to have access to our online database. And the amazing thing about that is you'll be able to actually um, communicate with other students enrolled in the class. And you'll also be able to um, hook up with New York Jazz Academy teachers and get feedback um, from them. I think learning jazz is always a two-way street, so you want to make sure that you go into this process not just passively watching videos, um, but taking it a step farther and really interacting with people who know um, about jazz history and have really worked on this. So anyway, thank you again for tuning in to New York Jazz Academy Online. I look forward to sharing with you Jazz History 101, and good luck with your musical journey.